Assalamu alaikum. Hello everyone. Today we will talk about uh, augmented mean group, uh, common correlated effect mean group, and a new cross section dependence test by Pesaran uh, 2015. Uh, there are several benefits of using augmented mean group and common correlated effect mean group. Uh, but the most uh, uh, prominent feature that deals by both of these tests are slope heterogeneity. Uh, it deals with the problem of heterogeneity. And it also deals with the problem of um, cross-section dependence. Along with that, it also incorporates unobserved factors. So let's just talk about uh, and and we also have another test cross section dependence test uh, a weak weak cross section dependency test so first of all let's start with the amg and then we will follow ccmg and then we will go to the cd test so first of all as you know about the panel command i have already done all the things so let's just run a simple mean group model we have arc for the augmented mean group, trend, and worst. We can get the residuals by naming it arc1. Once we get the results, uh, these are basically the results for the augmented mean group. And we can also get the results for the common correlated effect just by changing arc to CCE, which is means common correlated effect mean group. And we will name this uh, residuals as CCE1. Uh, since my data basically have more cross sections than the time series, and uh, this test, uh, the cross section dependence by Pesaran, uh, it is useful when you have more cross sections than the time series, so you can use it. So the command for this is basically xtcd2 and uh, then you can put the residuals. Let's suppose I want to put this residual. I got uh, the result for the weak cross-section uh, dependent. Uh, actually, uh, weak uh, cross-section dependency is linked with the uh, economic proximity and uh, strong cross-section dependence is linked with the uh, demand shocks, macroeconomic shocks and change in the economic structure. So I hope uh, this video is uh, useful for you people and especially for those people who are working with uh, panel data. Thank you very much for watching and stay tuned for further videos.